What's going on, beautiful people of YouTube? This is Reen Bean, and we got us another fantastic overseas product here. Um, this is episode number five, so that is awesome. Um, I have no idea what to call this series. You know, I've been trying to come up with a name that makes this sound catchy, makes it easier when I titleize these things. Titleize, what kind of word is that? Uh, when I make the titles for these. Uh, maybe one of y'all out there can help me come up with a name for these series, but basically what I do, if you do not know from my previous videos, is we order these bootleg knockoff systems. These are handheld gaming consoles. I haven't found one yet that I wanted that was an actual console we'll plug up to a TV. Maybe soon. Uh, but these are handheld consoles, much like Game Boy or DS or PSP. They're knockoffs. They're terrible. They're, well, I ain't going to say they're terrible. I've had one good one. Um, but I unbox it, I review it, I give it my first impressions, and we go from there. I have no idea if this works, if it is, uh, what kind of condition it is. It is when, when it's open now is when I see it. So These things take a while to come in. They usually take a couple weeks because they're coming from overseas. So the, the time frame on there is hard. I'm trying to keep these uh, regular for these videos. This is, uh, like I said, this is episode 5, so this is the fifth one. I got two more coming in, and I'm always on the hunt for these things. Uh, these things are not easy to find, actually. I mean, and it... Or at least cheap now. This one is $14.99. And actually, I'm, I'm excited about this one because I'll tell you, I feel a box. It feels like there's an actual box in this. Now, I have not had one yet that comes with its own carrying case or its own box. That'll be awesome if, if that's what it is. I don't know yet, but we're going to find out. But what I do is I print out the specs here. We're going to go over. These are directly from eBay's description, so I cannot make this stuff up. This is how they typed it in, so hopefully it's decipherable, but usually it isn't. But anyways, here we go. Now, this is the... O player MGS 272B game console controller. All right, then that's a good start. This is the classic game console for spending leisure time breezily. All right, <laughs> in built in 200 games so that you can choose the one that you like. Meanwhile, allows you to play games uh, to play games. See, it's hard to read this stuff to play games for a long time with no repetition. Uh, we're, we're, we are not off to a good start as far as uh, what we're doing here. All right, it had, all right, well, I'm going to say I'm trying to do it like a proper sense. With 3.5 millimeter audio jack enables you to connect it with earphones for an immersive gaming experience. I'm excited about that. I'm ready to be immersed. The main features, we got portable game console with 200 fantastic games built in, a 2.7 inch LCD TFT screen with crystal clear sharp images. The Now, this... The resolution is 960 by 240 pixels. That seems high. I don't know why. Powered by three AAA batteries, not included. They never are, but I do keep those up here. I keep some cheap ones on hand. Uh, with mini USB power port, you can connect it to PC by USB cable to play it directly without battery. Do not support charge the battery through it. All right. Built-in 3.5 earphones jack. I believe that was covered up uh, above this. Uh, compact and portable, suitable for age group four above. Excellent. Model MGS 272B compatible with built-in games. The screen size is 2.7 inch. The battery type is removable. The package contents one game console, one USB cable, one English user manual. And yes, this is $14.99. Do not let the looks deceive you. This thing is going to be fantastic. At least I'm being optimistic. So let's, without further ado, let's crack it in this. Now I do got to say there's some bad news. I lost my damn skeleton key, but until then we got a new one, at least to use now. So hopefully... This thing's gonna be awesome. I'm ready to crack into it and see what this is about. And, oh, it does have a box. I can already see it now. I'm excited. It's a little crushed, but hell, that's fine. Now, to, to pay $15 and get a display box, oh, this is gonna be great. Are you ready for this? Woo! The O player. Now, that is, ah, the box is beat the hell. But you gotta keep in mind, this thing's coming all the way from, I believe it was China. Let's see. Uh, yeah, China. Fuck. All right. Yeah, the box is beat up. Not terrible. Oh lord. Oh, there's the there's the front of it. Oh, I can already say I'm not happy about the way the buttons are. I hate the way they do buttons like that. Why can't it be at least the other way? Uh, but that's cool looking. I'm happy about the box. Let's crack. Oh, let's crack into this thing. Let's throw this package. We don't need it. Well, actually, is there anything in it? Nope, they didn't. I know one of them uh, gave me a note because they sent me the wrong color, and the note was funny as hell. If you uh, you need to check that out on my, I can't remember which episode it was, but oh, it was it was it was disappointing, but it was funny at the same time. All right, let's open this up. I'm gonna have to try to fix this box later because I want that thing on the shelf to, to display this magnificent beast. Now I'll tell you that feels actually kind of heavy, which is a 
kind of a good thing with something like this. Well, that ain't as heavy as I thought, but god damn it, the buttons. Look at that. It's got the A and B right here, but they're like this. Like, who who plays like that? I mean, I guess I could do that right there. It's got the It's got the screen protector, which is the first one of these I have seen that has a screen protector. Uh, so look at that. That's the best part whenever you get something like a handheld. Look at that. Oh, God, that's beautiful. Oh, it'll be scratched soon enough, I'm sure. There is the uh, the high-end, uh, high-speed USB cable. Uh, probably made by Munster. Uh, I doubt that. All right. God, we got a huge flathead to take this thing. I'll see if the Universal Skeleton Key can crack you open. There we go. I think it was kind of on there. See what we can take. I gotta throw these batteries in there. I'm ready to crack it. Now you know if you if you see these, I'll always leave the link in the description if you ever want to buy one of these products. Uh, whenever you go through and you look at the pictures, they always have like some awesome picture of Mario from like the Wii or something. Like you're gonna play that on one of these, but all most all the time it's just a ROM of an NES game you get on these and like some other bootleg games that you've never heard of. But we might get lucky with this. Who knows? Let's see what we got. Now, I ha I've yet to have a dud, and I say that in every video, but uh, one day I just might, or it's just going to be a brick, and that would just be a sucky video. All right, let's put you back on there. I don't think we have to crank you down too tight. Uh, just enough to be on there so you won't bother me. All right. I see we got a volume knob up here, and there is the power button. Are we ready for this? Now this is two point now two point seven inches. I will say, I think this is the biggest one that I got. Oh, it's on. There it is. All right, Family Zeus. Oh no, <laughs> Family Zeus. I thought that's it. Family two hundred. Family Sport two hundred and one. That's weird. Look, all right, press A. Let's see how loud you get. Not terrible. Not great, but not terrible. Alright. Press A. Puzzle, action, venture, table, sport, relax. Action. I wonder if these aren't going to be ROMs. Let's see here. Let's go into action. Jumping Mary. Robot War. Balloon Boy. I wonder if that's like Balloon Fight. No? Are these... Are these original games or different games? Now this is like Balloon Fight, sort of. What are we doing? I have no idea the objective in this, but I f did terrible already. Oh, I'm optimistic. Oh yeah, this is this is a uh, fucking yeah. All right, all right, all right. Let's see what else we got. Now the graphics were not bad. I'm not I'm not hating it. The only the only thing I'm hating so far is the button layout. Alright, let's see here. I've yet to encounter an NES ROM. Climbing expert. Would that be like Ice Climber, maybe? Fuck, no, these are original. Oh my god! What? Oh, I got magnificent blonde hair. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, you're just, you're continually climbing. Okay. I have no idea. Okay, that's cool. Now these may not be awesome games, but they're not like bootleg. It's not like Contra 20 times that you see on all of them. Holy shit! Sea fight, trans prop. What in the world? Panda labyrinth, chess. I you can't mess chess up. Bomb chain unlimited, puzzle ball. Did I? Oh, I clicked the puzzles. Let me get out of here. Venture. What is the difference between venture and action? Table, sport, re what are what are relax games? Benthel, Jew, Linking, Homeward Journey? Homeward Journey. Oh my god. I was hoping for the sequel of Homeward Bound. What is this? What the fuck? You know, I'm... This ain't bad, people. This is... Uh... A bunch of games, but none of them are, are your basic rip-off ROMs. So if that if all these are 200 original games, that's cool. I mean they may they may suck, but that's the coolest thing that I've seen so far. Even the PSP or the PXP3 uh, had had a bunch of bootleg ROMs in there. Jack Adventure is that an actual? There we go. 
What in the world? The graphics are pretty damn impressive, too. Oh, that's simplistic. Look, that, that's his crouch. I don't know if you can... Come on and... And focus, you piece of fuck camera. Well, you can't... His crouch is terrible. And the D-pad's responsive. The buttons are, too. I hate the, pla the placement of that. This ain't terrible. This is... I could dick around with this. Let's try a few more, and then... You know, I'm... I tell you what, people. I died. Of course I died. I'm trying to reset. Here. There we go. Let's get out of that. Gre greedy girl. It's most of them out there now. Come on. Level 1. I do think th these may be like knockoff games, but they're original. Or as far as they're like... You know what I mean. Alright. This is this is cool, man. I'm happy about this. $15. Is, I'm going to say 15 well spent. This is like a 4 out of 5. It would be a 5 out of 5 had it been that the buttons were in a better placement, but to relax. I got a picture of a margarita, a little drink there. Tell how much I drink. Alright. Uh, sport. Let's see what kind of... Rally, GT racing. Oh, they're all racing. Mini soccer, table, archery. Let's see what archery's about. How good are them graphics? Look at that! Look at the graphics on that! Not terrible! I'm sorry if it's not focusing, but hell, this camera just does not... There we go. Hmm. Alright. Oh, I see. I can kind of... Cool, man. Cool. And it's built pretty solid. No no flickering. It doesn't have any motion blur. There's a USB slot. There's your headphone jack. I'm going to say it, people. That's a good one. We rarely get good ones on this channel. And I'm turning that off. I'm going to have to play with that later. Uh, it has an awesome box. Uh, well, it's not awesome. It's pretty cheap, but it has a box. That's cool. Uh, you don't see that with any of them. Uh, super happy about that one. $14.99. I will leave a link in the description. Uh, pick one of those up and play with it. That'd be great to keep in the bathroom right there. Who knows what you'll do with that thing. Be in the doctor's office. Who knows? Uh, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Damn it, we are close to 2,000 subscribers. We need to get there. Uh, if you see this video, hit that like button. Share this. Let someone else see this. See what the hell I put myself through. Every now and then we get a pretty good jewel to look at. Uh, a lot of times we don't. But hey, I do it because I love these things. I love collecting them. They're awesome. They're little cheap bootleg knockoff systems. Uh, very cool. But I hope y'all like this. And as always, take care. And thank you so much for watching.